Hi everyone, this is my computer. It's a, an ordinary AMD dual core um, Athlon CPU. Um, it has about 6 gigabytes of RAM and 1 terabyte hard drive. Um, and it is obviously running Linux. Um, the reason I'm making this video is just to elucidate something. This, this computer has two uh, displays. It's running two different desktops. Under under GNOME, and my Linux machine has the two cores topping everything there is to top. I mean, CPU one just hit 100%, and CPU two is just doing the same um, alternatively. Why is this happening? Uh, the memory load is actually around three gigs out of 5.8 available, as I told you, six gigabytes, and the network is just jumping around uh, along uh, normally I have a one um, gigabit link why is this happening well this is happening because my Linux machine um, which has again um, a dual core Atlum uh, 5000 plus and a one terabyte hard drive which is almost empty um, is actually doing a hell of a lot of stuff now here you can see VMware running most of my machines are stopped but I, ha I do have a Windows machine uh, working Windows 7 64-bit and it's running a lot of stuff as you can see here I'm running, running Flash Builder which is kinda heavy Cold Fusion um, Studio which is also very heavy and not under the same instance of Eclipse it's a different instance I'm running two instances of MySQL uh, query browser, another for the administrator running a small session of um, WinSCP. I am running TeamViewer so I can log in remotely and I'm also using Chrome which is uh, kinda light but not that light. Um, the thing is that my software is also running on the Linux side. Um, it is also running Mozilla with a lot of uh, tabs here as you can see and it is also um, doing something oh, this is just a folder I'm opening on a network uh, and system monitor which does take up space on the other workspace here as you can see I am running several instances almost 20 instances of DVD created and they are all running okay so my machine is processing like 20 DVDs it's encrypting and decrypting video. Um, it's not blazing fast, but it, none of them has stopped. And you can see that just I can still use the machine and work with it. Okay, it's not blazing fast, but it's it is workable. Okay, the thing is that my other workspace is also with a lot of stuff. So I do have I still have OpenShot. Um, uh, working here, it, it stopped already. It already stopped processing video, but it is open with the video project. I'm not closing it. Uh, yeah, I'm saving the project. Um, I also have my network open. Oh, um, it just stopped baking a, a DVD, which I was cooking, <laughs> and Gnome Baker um, ended doing what he, he was doing. I don't want to save changes. And I still have Qubit Torrent um, downloading stuff. Uh, and it was installing, it's just ended installing some software. Um, again, uh, <laughs> I'm not an anti Windows person, I just don't like an efficiency. I would love to see a video like this having Windows do just the same as this Linux machine is doing with the same hardware and resources with the same. Uh, capacity of, of letting you still work your projects while it's doing so much processing um, underneath everything so Linux is beautiful just for you to know I'm running uh, Ubuntu Studio 10.4 uh, I believe 64-bit um, evidently um, and I've told you what the, the hardware is already okay bye bye